Fucked up. Simple, I receive demands from all levels of the bureaucracy. How am I supposed to balance this and the people? The president demands one thing, the mob another. Guys, this isn't really working. We need to plan an idea in their subconscious now. Otherwise, it gives them cops. Hurry. If only I could farm, like my ancestors did in the past, the government wouldn't have to redistribute any land, and I and other farmers just like myself could make use of it to its maximum potential. Aha! I got it! I can finance these people through short-term loans, giving them the resources that they need to determine their own destiny without me stressing, on my, own, stressing my own budget. I don't need John Deere tractors or GE light bulbs, but I can grow maize and sorghum, which will not only help provide food for my family, but maintain my traditional identity. If I can distribute local crops, then I can help the, I can help stabilize the local infrastructure and ensure a better future for Zimbabwe. If only I can maintain food aid for a little longer, then the local harvest can pay for themselves. The Mugabe regime's policies don't necessarily have to coincide with those of the WFP. We can coexist independently with neither bullying the other. Aha! If we decrease food aid slowly, while slowly increasing the budget for the sustainable food programs, we can slowly wean people off this Western malice. Perhaps the president can replace the feather in his cap after the failed hunger programs of the 1980s. Guys, the collapsing. Hurry, we have to get out of here. Sign up right here. Cash now. Buy livestock seeds. Invest in your future. You see, world news for Aurora is a luxury thing. You can give a man a fish, you can feed him for a day. You can teach a man a fish, you can eat for a lifetime. Today is the Bob Way law has been taken to its self sufficiency. After years of resentment and animosity between the Mugabe regime, the World Food Program, and other non-governmental organizations and local farmers, these three groups have come together in a landmark coalition to foster local and national growth. Through the distribution of native properties and increased availability of microfinance, people of Zimbabwe, who slowly weaned up the food aid, are now able to overcome the land distribution issues to create a model for all of Sub-Saharan Africa, now to Matthew Price. Black the WFT from their headquarters in Rome announced. 